Hello everyone and welcome back to No Man's Land. So, today is a day for harvesting. I have sprayed these guys with weeds, they uh, with herbicide, they're not going to be ready by the end of the episode I don't think, but that's fine. We've got two fields to harvest. The first one is this lovely soybean field, which uh, I think we'll probably sell from straight away. Um, we'll have a look at the price and see how it is. Excuse me a moment, that was my chair making noise. So, yeah, we're going to crack on with this. Obviously we've got straw as well, so I would like to try and get the straw collected at the same time. But we will see. Now, I have decided, since returning from FarmCon, um, that I'm going to start the FS22 series early. Now, I did say I'd be doing it sometime soon, probably an overlap. We are now episode 68. This is 68 here. And I said I would go to around 70 or 80, which is a really long series anyway. So, I think I know which map I want to do. I'm not 100% sure yet, but I'm pretty sure. So, we are going to be doing that soon. I'm going to be starting that series. Now the way it's going to work is I will actually do one episode at the very start just to introduce you to the farm, show you around the map in case you haven't seen it before. It's actually a map. If I stick with the one I'm thinking of, it's actually a map that I've been waiting for for over a year to be released. Even before FS22 was released, this map was being produced. Um, it's an absolutely beautiful map, and I'm really excited to play on it. So, that's what I'm thinking. Because I need a map that I'm going to want to stay on for five years. Now, obviously not five real-time years, but, um, yeah, five... five in-game years. Now, two days per season, um, 12 months a year, sorry, 2 days per month, 12 months a year, 24 times 5, that would be 120 episodes. We're not going to do that many, because, of course, I'm going to be skipping some days. If there's nothing to do, then days will be skipped. Um, the only dilemma I have is whether I start the series in January, all started in August, I think it's August is the default start date. Um, now, because I'm kind of getting a little bit ahead of myself here, I'm actually going to start that series before I even release this episode. So I'm going to have to decide myself what I'm going to do. Um, I'm not yet sure, but we will see. But yes, we're, I'm, I'm quite excited to start that series. Um, being at FarmCon, kind of made me want to play FS22 a lot more. I haven't given it as much of a chance as I should have done, so I think now is the right time to give it give it a go properly. Um, as I said, there will actually be one more FS19 series. When this series finishes, it will be taken over by another one, which is one that I've been really looking forward to as well. Um, yeah. Now, as for No Man's Land, because that's where we are right now, we have paid the loan for today. We're doing pretty well. Um, still got a fair, fairly big chunk of loan to pay, but we are making money. We've got greenhouses are ticking money by every hour, and the income from the milk and all that kind of stuff it's all going pretty well. I am happy. But we need more because I currently have a big stack of wood products and I have nothing to do with them. So we need to resolve that situation, but I would like to avoid taking out more of a loan. So we need to get ourselves some cash so that we can do that. Now I could sell some of it. In fact, we probably will sell a trailer load just so that I've got, um, just so it can start processing again. But yeah, um, we're doing pretty well. I'm happy with where we are. 
admittedly, if I wasn't happy, it would be too late because, like I said, episode 68. So, we now need to get this field collected. Pretty, no, sorry, collected, harvested. Pretty sharp. Uh, so, I think we're going to launch into a time lapse. I'm a little nervous about time. I want to get all the straw collected as well as the wheat field harvested. So, I'll drop it down to five. And yeah, start the time lapse. Alright, so we are almost there. Not much left to do. We got a pretty good yield out of this so far. What I'm going to do after this is I'm not going to do the wheat straight away because we, we might leave that for next time. Instead what I'm going to do is I'm going to test. I'm interested to know if I can use the baler to pick up the straw. Because if I can, it will just make things a little bit easier. So I will give that a go. Um, and yeah, I'll test that out. So, there will be a little bit of a jump cut because obviously I'll have to finish the field and then I'll jump to trying out the baler. Um, if the baler doesn't work, then you'll know because I won't come back in a baler, I'll come back in a um, loading wagon. Or well, technically, with a tr I'll be in a tractor with one of those attached, but you know what I mean. So, yep, yeah, see you in a minute when everything is done and we're ready to the next step. Okay, so great news. This is working. So, what that means is I'm going to take this up to. We'll try 10,000 and see how quickly it fills up. I might go for 20,000, but we will see. But yeah, this is. Uh, 
this is going to make life a lot easier now that I can bail it. Because what it means is that I can uh, have less collections. Oops. Wrong button. There we go. And it's the wrong direction. Not doing very well here. Yeah, so, uh, alright, that's still filling up fairly quickly. I think we're going to go for 20,000. Um, once it looks like I'm going to be running out of space, I will not do that. Uh, sorry, running out of straw even. I'll change it back to 10,000. But for now, we'll go with 20 because then it's just less trips to the shop as well. And I did fill up the trailer. The trailer is completely full of soybeans and there's a little bit left in the harvester. So that is great news because it means we've got more than 18,000 litres. So yeah, what we're going to do now then is another time lapse I'm afraid, but let's, uh, let's get that going. Just a small little bit left to do. We have got a pretty good amount out of this field. Now I realised that I don't mind if there's actually not a finished bale in here because we're going to be getting normal kind of wheat straw from the field when we harvest it. So why not use that wheat straw? 
to make ourselves another soybean bell. That is a genius idea, I think. So, fold this guy up. Uh, and we'll just we'll just pop him over here. Now the field has progressed again. That's good. So what do I need to do? I need to find the bales and then get the trailer. The trailer, I guess. Yeah, of course the trailer's up there. But right, let's go and sell what's in here. Um, I think we've got room in both firewood piles, which is good. And of course, yes, I, I will get this harvested. I may actually harvest off screen. I'm not, I'm not sure. I haven't decided. So you are empty. And you have got room. Perfect. That is fantastic news. Oh my goodness. Look at the mess of straps I put on. How do I even get them off? There we go, that's one. That's another. Oh, this is awful. Why did I put so many straps on? Right, you. Gotta go away from that pit. And there we go, there's one sold. And we'll sell the other quickly. And then I can grab this and quickly off camera I will put all the bells up onto here and then that way we can get cracking with selling them I'm interested to know how much we're going to get so the 5262 for that right let me grab a tractor and we will just get those bells collected I'll see you in a moment Five bales then, each with 20,000 litres, so that's 100,000 litres of canola straw here. We had a little over 10,000 left in the um, baler as well. So tip side, I have never tried doing this, so we're going to do it for the first time now. Uh, unload here. Do they actually slide off when I do this? That is the big question. Yes they do. Wow. 9,938. I don't know why. I thought there was going to be more. Um, let's stop you from doing that. Okay, so I'm just going to drop off this trailer very quickly. And then we're going to switch to the soybeans. Um, yeah. We're going to sell the soybeans. Because that is a job that needs to be done. Let me go and switch him over very quickly. Come on, buddy. Notice this JCB has a lot of power, but a very poor turning circle. Now, I have not used another large tractor for a while, so yeah, it's been quite a Because I do Let's Plays pretty much exclusively on FS19 don't really play much on my own anymore. Um, I've kind of forgotten how much... Why am I going here? Uh, I've forgotten what it's like driving large tractors and if they all behave like that. Right, now soybeans. Vehicle shop grains is the best. Okay, good. I just realised that while I was driving up that I should probably check if this is the best place to sell it. Makes sense, right? So, anyway get ourselves some more money as I always tell you don't expect to be rich we're not going to be making a fortune here but let's get some money at least and how much milk have we got at the moment 14,000 nice the money is going up nicely 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 Fifteen thousand four hundred and five. Okay, so I need to grab the other thousand or so liters that are in the harvester, and then I'll come back and we'll sell that. 
A thousand and seventy one, so not a big haul here, but we get it sold anyway. And we'll see how much we get. Come on, it takes so long to sell. Now, what have we got here that's blocking? I know we've got something. Yeah, so the planks. 970 for that. So, planks, 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 planks. We can sell them at the land trade. Right. I am going to take this tractor, grab the flatbed trailer, and I'm going to put as many pallets as I can onto there, and we're going to take them over to Agra's land trade and sell them. So I'll see you in a minute when I've got a full trailer. This then is 30,000 litres, so that should now... Yes, he is now active, he can start processing again, which is great. We've still got a lot of logs left in there, and of course we've got no worries about the number of logs available on the map. There's quite a lot of them. Yes, a lot. Um, but anyway, we are going to sell this. I have got absolutely no idea how much we're going to make. I guess around 735... Seven, I think around 21,000, but I'm not quite sure. So we don't want to sell at this one here, because that is the wood sell point. We actually want to take it round the back to the main selling point, because that he wants to be. Now, however, I cannot drive. So, if we unstrap those, I guess, can I tip them like last time? No, you know what? I'm not going to tip them like last time. I'm going to throw them off. There we go. Money's going up. Nicely. Cool. Three and a half thousand. Very, very good. I'm liking this money. It's a good amount of money. Especially considering we've got a lot more of this available. So we've got one left after this. There we go. Okay, so that takes us up to 108,933. Hmm, this is very, very good. I'm going to go and get myself a second trailer, and I will come back and we can sell that as well. See you in a moment. Here we are then with another six. So this time I'll make the turn. Woohoo! There we go, I did it. Isn't that amazing? All these hours of farming simulator, I finally learned how to drive. I know. So we'll get these sold. And then I think, I think, it's pretty much it for the episode. Now, we're going to come back next episode um, and we're going to do it split by days because I would like to get the harvesting done um, of the wheat in today rather than tomorrow, if that makes sense. So, I think that's what I will do. So, we'll finish the episode here with 131,463. That is a very nice amount. So yeah, we'll finish it here and tomorrow we'll be back and we'll do the wheat harvesting. So, for now, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very, very much for watching. Have a lovely day, and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.